right, today we're going to be working on catching our Frisbee. There are two ways that we're going to catch. I'm going to show you the first way, which is called the alligator catch. When you're doing an alligator catch, you want to have your hands close together. You don't have to have them touching, but don't have them far apart because you won't get your hands down in time. Make sure you're not pointing your fingers toward the Frisbee. They have to be up and down. When the frisbee comes in, your bottom hand and top hand are gonna catch the frisbee. Bottom hand on the bottom of the frisbee, top hand on the top. Now Mr. Pickard and I are gonna show you how to do an alligator catch. Start close together. Make sure you get ready. Have those hands ready to catch it. Take a step back. you keep throwing it the way we taught you. This is an alligator catch. Our second way we can catch a frisbee is we call it a hamburger style. So you can pretend like your frisbee is a big juicy hamburger and your hands kind of make like that seize because you're going to hold on to your hamburger like you're eating a hamburger. So when that frisbee's coming, you're going to clamp down on the side so that when I catch it, it looks like I'm just eating a hamburger. So once again, Mrs. Picker and I are going to throw it and we're going to be using the hamburger style to catch. Start close. When I catch it, it looks like I'm eating a nice juicy hamburger. Once you got this, take a step back just a little bit further. Now, after a couple times that you've done both the alligator and the hamburger, I want you to go back through a third time and practice on the one that you think is harder for you. So if an alligator, if you're having trouble catching an alligator, okay, you're gonna practice catching that alligator again. Or if you're having trouble doing the hamburger, practice doing the hamburger. So you're just gonna keep working on the one that you thought that you need more practice on. Have fun, guys. <laughs> 